What is up guys, it is Janine. Welcome back to my channel. On today's video, I'm going to be reviewing a new self tanning mousse for you guys. If you guys follow me on Instagram, which I will pop it up here, or if you've been watching these videos for a while, you know that I like, I love self tanning products. I always have, I just feel like I look and feel my best when I'm tan. And I'm always on the hunt for new, like, innovative, amazing self tanning products. I've discovered a lot of good ones over the years as well as some horrible ones. So when I find a good one, I love to share it. So this one is an amazing one and I cannot wait to share it. The brand I'm reviewing for today's video is Coco and Eve. Have you heard of this product? First of all, I'm obsessed with the packaging. I love the coloring and I'm, I'm a sucker for the whole process. I like the way things are packaged. I like the, the brand colors. That's important to me. I know that's ridiculous, but it is. So when I saw that the packaging was super cute, I'm like, okay, I really hope I love this product. Um, here is some other packaging. How cute, right? With the like banana leaves. I just, I just love it. Anyways. Um, so I was really, you know, hoping that I loved the product as well, but when it comes to self tanning products, some of the nightmares I've run into are products that stink. Number one smell is, is the number one problem I've run into with products. So smell number two is the color. The color is just not right. It gets orangey or when it comes off, it's streaky and it does not come, it does not fade evenly. So Coco and Eve, this is a, um, the Bally bronzing foam and I got it in dark because I already have like an olive skin tone. And so I got dark. It comes in three colors, medium, dark, and ultra dark. Um, so I've got basically the, the one in the middle, which is dark. And this, the cool thing about this is you don't need an additional product for your face in terms of the tanning mousse. Um, but there is a face product that I use also in connection with this. And I'll kind of go over what my routine is with the product, um, but I just wanted to show you all of the individual products. So it's the Sunny Honey Bally Bronzing Foam, and then it's the Bronzing Face Drops. This is actually one of the unique products that um, I love the most from this company. And it is this like Kabuki style brush for applying self tanner. And I've never, seen that before with any of the other companies I've reviewed and it is so that you can blend out your wrists, your hands, your um, um, get it all into your hairline and really just buff out those areas that can be kind of difficult. The elbows, the ankles, your toes. Um, and so I love that. I thought that that was such a, a unique product and I never thought about using something like this. And I'm so glad that they use, they have this as part of their bundle. So if you purchase it in a bundle, you're going to get this little brush, which I think is amazing. And then this is the mitt. Obviously it's dirty because I've been using it, but I like that it, you can keep it in here so that, you know, you don't get product on your other stuff in your cabinet or whatever. You can put it right back into this little reusable sleeve. Same thing with the Kabuki brush thing. And, but I love the material. This is almost like a velvet velour kind of material. And again, I feel that it allows for really good um, blending of the product and easy blending. So it's like a really smooth finish. So I'm gonna pop up um, a video of me applying the product. It's actually really easy. What I do is I always will put on um, a wear black or like a bandeau or black underwear or something. And, um, I make sure that I, my skin is clean and exfoliated. So I will exfoliate in the shower and just so that I have a nice surface. I also prefer to moisturize my skin before I tan. I feel like this helps me have an even, uh, an even, um, suntan afterwards that there's no patchy rough areas so when you moisturize yourself just make sure you allow the moisturizer to fully penetrate and then once it's fully penetrated you're ready to tan so basically you just put the tan on the put the the mousse on the uh the mitt and you just kind of like rub it all over i usually do it by myself and there's just like a couple of spots that sometimes I miss on my back and I'll have my husband pop in and do my back sometimes. But if he's not available, 
I can usually do a pretty good job all by myself. Um, and that's only about once a week. So I basically will do the mousse about once a week. It'll slowly fade and, and then you exfoliate and do it again. So that's what I do for my body. Now for the face, it's a little different because with your face, um, you're exfoliating your face more often and with makeup and makeup remover and all of that, like it fades a lot faster. So my routine with the face is to apply the, the mousse every other day or sometimes every three days. It just really depends, but it's one, every one to three days I will do the mousse. And I, again, I, I love this brush cause you can really get it into your hairline and, and do your neck and all of that. But you guys, these drops, oops, these drops, I am obsessed with. Actually, I took them out of the box. They're in my drawer. I'm obsessed with these drops. These are like the best face tan drops. I love them. I You basically will just put a little bit, one, you can squeeze the top right here. There's like a little ball. You just press down and I do three drops into my moisturizer and I just rub my hands together and apply it all over my face. And I do that every single day. So that just ensures that I am going to, that I'm gonna have like a nice golden glow every day. And I absolutely love it. I actually use, um, this is a fairly newer product for me and I did a product review on this product as well. I'm gonna pop it up here. Um, the video I did on this product because it's amazing. And I believe it's a sister company for Coco and Eve and it's called Sand and Sky. But this is the um, water or what is this called? The Tasmanian Spring Water Boost Cream. And I will just scoop a little bit of that into my hand, put three drops of the tanning drops. And that is my my moisturizing routine every single day. And I love it. Like I feel like I have this nice pretty bronzy glow all the time and it's not hard to maintain. So some of the things I love about this product are it has no smell. It smell, I mean, it has no bad smell. It basically smells like vacation. If it smells like vacation in a bottle and it does not have that strong pungent, um, smell that most of these do there it's it's totally clean it's cruelty free like none of the nasty stuff that's in a lot of these types of products i know that there's a lot of people that don't do self tanning because of all of the bad chemicals and you know if people are trying to trying to really have a clean um skincare and beauty routine they they avoid these types of products because they're usually loaded with chemicals. And I've, I've tried my fair share of these types of products and I know that they're not wrong. Um, so the smell is amazing. The color is different. It almost has like a grayish green look to it. And as you can see, I popped up the video here of me applying it onto the mitt. You can see it has like a funky color. Don't let that scare you. That tint is actually what's preventing your color from looking orange. There's nothing worse to me than an orange sunless tan. I absolutely hate it. So I love that this product is just like a pretty golden glow and um, that weird tint to the product, it, that's what's doing that. That's what's making sure that we do not end up orange. Um, and then, like I said, some of my favorite parts of, the, of this whole line are, I love this, I think this is amazing, really helps making tanning your wrists a, a whole lot easier. And um, the face drops are an everyday absolute must for me. So I give this product literally 10 out of 10. It hit all of the things I look for in a self tanning product. Um, and so it is definitely going to be a part of my weekly routine for a long time. I, I really have not loved a self tanning product. I can't even remember if I've loved a self tanning product as much as this one. This one really blew me out of the water. And, and I highly recommend giving them a try. Um, their products are amazing. I can't wait to try more of them. I've been so happy with everything that I've tried. I do have a discount code for them. It's code Janine. And I will link all of this stuff down in the description box. Let me know if you have any questions, guys. But like I said, if you like, if you like self-tanning products and you have not tried these, I highly recommend. Their, their shipping is also very, very fast. Um, and the packaging. Can't get over the packaging. So 
Hopefully you guys give it a try and let me know what you think. Comment below. I would love to um, answer any questions you may have. Thank you so much, guys. We'll see you on the next one.